cooking with Katrina with the K and not just food only. Guess what we're about to make? We're gonna make us some lit cube jello shots. Yes, lit cube jello shots. You're probably wondering why you see some peach crown royal sitting there and some red berry Amsterdam. Well, let me tell you why you see this sitting now. Because we're gonna try something different. We're gonna try, uh, we're gonna use the grape with the uh, red berry Amsterdam cubes. And then we're gonna use this peach jello and try some peach crowns in it. So yeah, y'all yeah, stay tuned. Let's see how this gonna, gonna work out for us. Let me check on this water cause it, it is boiling right now. Yeah. Use our peach jello mix. Try this one first. Yes, we're gonna have us some, some lit cube shots. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna pour our mixture on in here. Then we're supposed to add one cup of hot water and stir until the crystals are dissolved because we don't want it chewy, 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 chewy. We want it perfect, right? Right. So let's get some service. Let's get the spark. Just which is stirring, so we're gonna stir, stir, stir. So everything has dissolved in this bowl. And I don't want to make them too strong. So I think I'm going to use a half a cup of uh, cold water and a half a cup of uh, alcohol instead of a whole cup of alcohol versus a whole cup of hot water. So we're going to do half and half because we don't want to make them too, too strong. We don't want to waste our alcohol either. Yes, baby. So I think it's looking good. Let me open these blinds up, get a little more natural light in here. So now we're gonna add a half a cup of this. Take this out the way. And throw this stuff over. peach crown to our mix. Oh, half a cup is a lot. So yeah, we're gonna do half and half. So we're gonna add half. Let's close this back up. Let's stir this half a cup in here right now. And then we need a half a cup of cold. So let me get a half a cup of cold. And go ahead and add that in to complete our one cup of cold liquids. Add it. So that is nice and sturdy, sturdy, sturdy. Oh, it smells so good, y'all. All this peachy, peachy, peachiness over here. All right, so now that we have that stirred up, let's go on and start adding it to our ice tray, baby. So we can go ahead and make our intoxicating jello cube shots. 
Yes, we're going to fill these to the top. Uh-oh. I can't wait to taste them. They are already looking good. I never had a uh, jello shots with brown looking, so this is a first for me. Okay, y'all, yes, we almost finished. We have a couple more cubes to go. And we'll be finished with this one. And then on to the next one, which is great. And I'm going to pour the rest of this into a little mold and make a, a mold. I'm not going to mix the two liquors together. Okay, we're going to pour all the extra into these little containers right here and make smaller molds. Oh, shoot, I might just mix it together because it's not that much in here. So, yeah, I'm just gonna mix it together. Bam, bam. Just like that, instead of wasting dishes, baby. All right, on to the next one. On to grape. Now we're going to pour in our cup of hot water, piping hot water, might I add. Then you know what we do next, stir, stir, stir. So everything is dissolved, all the crystals have dissolved in here. All right, I think that's good enough, y'all. Now we're gonna add our cup of, half a cup of cold water. Stir that in real good. And then we'll add a half a, a cup of the red berry vodka. And stir that in real good as well. Now we're gonna repeat the process like we did for the peach. We're gonna do it for this red berry, baby. We're gonna get our little scoop and scoop it right on in these little, right on in these little cubes. Oh, it smell good. I hope it tastes good. I know these will taste good. I just want to taste the ones with the brown liquor. Because I haven't had brown liquor before, like I was telling y'all earlier. Never tried it, but hey, we're going to try it today, baby. Yes, we are. I'll be sucking these things down like no other. make them too strong because I don't want my mom to be laid out on the floor in here. <laughs> so I'm going to be calling 911. Come pick her butt up. I don't know she's going to want to slurp something down. She going to want to join the party, baby. Party, party. 
All right, I think that's good enough, y'all. So now what we're gonna do, since we don't have a lot, we're just gonna mix it in here with this uh peach. Wow. Ooh, we got a mixed mold going on. Mix mold, mix mold. Rinse that out. 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 Jello is ready. Jello is ready. So let me go ahead and pour it out on a styrofoam plate and I'll be back here. All right, friends. I just popped them all out. Yes, we have our peach with our peach crown in it. And we have our grape with our red berry vodka in it. Then we have this mixed one in the middle with both drinks in it. Yes, baby. Ooh. Time for the big taste test. Let's see what it do. Mm -mm -mm. Let's see what it do. Mm. Ooh, that's so good, y'all. The one with the crown, the peach and crown, is good. First time for having that one, that was good. Oh, this grape tastes good, too. I can't wait to eat that center one. Mm, mm, mm. So good, so good. I made my mama a sample bowl of all the flavors. So let's go see what she say. Purple have red berry and the peach is a peach crown. So what you think about the purple that you eating now? Good taste alcohol. I know. And I ain't want to put too much. I only used a half cup each one. Okay, now that's the peach crown inside the peach. Tell me what it tastes like. You like it? No, I started to buy the peach crown or the apples, but I didn't. No, but you I will buy the peach. So you can taste it in the um, peach jello. Tastes good? All right, yeah. cool. Well, y'all, she says she like it. She up here sucking them down. We'll see. Hopefully, she won't be laid out here on this back patio when I come back here. <laughs> now, early, I almost moved. Shop. Girl, now. Going to the store? Uh-uh. Going. Walk to the park. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. See y'all. All right, friends. Well, you heard it from my mama. She said they were good. So on that note, we're going to go in this video. I want to thank you guys for watching Cooking with Katrina with the K and not just food only. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment down below, friends. Turn on your notification bells <laughs> for new videos, friends. And I hope everybody is out there staying safe, staying blessed. Yes, yes, yes. And I hope you enjoyed this video on um, making us some lit spike jello cubes <laughs> shots. But anywho, I'm going to see y'all next time. I want y'all to have a good one. All right, friends.